how to find slanted blur in CapCut, how we're going to use it. You want to first go ahead and import your CapCut project. It could be a photo or a video. And once you have your project, you want to at the bottom scroll until you find this effect button. So I'm going to go ahead and click on effects. And then there's going to be a couple of options where you want to click on video effects. Once you're in video effects, there should be a pop-up of all the trending effects that are currently in here. It normally wouldn't be in trending effects unless it's really trendy. So we want to go ahead and go to open and closing. And you want to essentially just search through all of these one by one. And so I've actually searched through lens and closing. It's not in there. It's also not in lens. Where in lens, you can actually find a lot of blurs. For example, you can see this motion blur. There's also normal blur. And so... When you go through all these, you should be able to find it. However, I've actually never found a slanted blur in all of these. So my conclusion is that CapCut may have actually removed this feature, slanted blur effect, for a temporary time. And they may have replaced it with a different type of blur that looks actually very similar to it. It's called the Poseidian Blur, and it's a pro feature. In opening and closing, you can see it's this blur. Or pixel blur, you can see that these blurs all look very similar to slanted blur. So it should be back after some time.